hi guys after a long time sorry for the late video because i'm a bit busy uh, these days so that's the reason why i have not uploaded any res uh, i mean any uh, videos okay so many persons are asking uh, for a uh, uh, trainings and everything so if you need trainings you can directly you know email me on knowledge36 at the rate gmail.com i'll just giving the same thing in a uh, description as well so you can just check it out guys okay so today we are going to discuss um, a topic called creating a label okay so creating a label is a quite easy thing so uh, i'll just uh, i'll show you a few steps to create a label so that you can just uh, able to create a uh, label okay so right click on your project first after right clicking on the project click on add you'll be able to see the new item okay just click on new item So whenever you just click on new item, this uh, template you'll be able to see in Dynamics 365 items. You'll be able to see these uh, like, you know, um, if you elaborate this uh, Dynamics 365 items, you'll be able to see this. In this, you have to select labels and resources. OK, so in the labels and resources, you have to select a label file because we are going to create a label, right? So now what we have to do is you have to just uh, give a um, proper name to a label. OK, so whenever you are creating a label file, just uh, keep that in your mind that you have to give a proper name. So for now, I'm just giving uh, taking the whatever the sample that we have. OK, just click on add. So after clicking on add, what we have to do is we have to follow whatever the label wizard, like label file wizard, we will be able to see. So this is a label file wizard. We have to follow these steps. Okay, see here it is asking the label file ID. So you can just give whatever the label file ID that you wish to. Okay, so after giving the label file ID, you have to click on next. Okay. So after clicking on next, it is asking us to select a language. So by default here, see this is the right side. You'll be able to see ENUS already. If your language is like different language, you can select from the left side available languages and you can select whatever the language that you are going to use for this labels. Okay. So after this, what we have to do is click on next. So after clicking on next, it will show some like summary page like uh, whatever what is the label file name means the, what's the file name of the label and what is the selected language which which language that you are selected. OK, so it, it is just giving a summary of whatever that we have created before. That's it. So just click on finish. So whenever you just click on finish, whatever the label file that we have already added, that will be added to our project. OK, let's see whether that got added to our project or not. Just cancel this. So see here the label file, whatever that we have created is like have added to our project. So that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye bye.